for the first time in the Natural Resource Unit. Today, we didn't use the framework that we introduced in the first lesson. If you recall, we saw how renewable resources can be accounted in that framework directly in the first lesson. Instead, today, we took a perhaps more general approach. After having discussed the characteristic of renewable resources, we studied their dynamics, and in particular, the logistic and biological regeneration functions that most of them exhibit. We saw how harvesting the resource interferes with such dynamics and can result in two different equilibria. They look similar, but one is stable and the other one is unstable. We discussed how renewable resources that are under open access may be used inefficiently and eventually collapse due to overexploitation, the so-called tragedy of the commons. We saw how the implementation of ownership rights may lead instead to an efficient use and may preserve the resource.